Hello there, I'm Bob Lusk, the editor of Pond Boss Magazine, and I'm in my 29th year as a private fisheries consultant, traveling the nation helping people design, build, stock, and manage private lakes and ponds. Today's pro tip is to tell you about how important habitat is for a pond. The very first thing I like to find out is what are your goals? Do you want to have a bass pond? Do you want to grow giant bluegill? What is it you really like to have? And then once I know that, the first thing we focus on after that is habitat, because as goes the habitat, so go the fish that live in it. Because one thing we gotta remember, if our ultimate goal is to grow a big, large mouth bass, it takes about 10 pounds of bait fish for that bass to get to be one pound. So we gotta grow a lot of bait fish, which means we gotta have the right kind of habitat. What is habitat? Habitat is where a fish needs to spawn, where a fish can hide, where a fish can feed, where fish can congregate or loaf. And if you can supply all those things, you've got habitat. Now one of the key things to remember, and most anglers will tell you this, 90% of the fish live in 10% of the water. So the entire pond bottom doesn't have to have some kind of habitat or structure. But you do want to have it at different depths. So figure out where you want to go with your goals, and then we can do things like this pond owner did right here behind us. If you look, you can see some rock piles. Scattered around this entire pond are piles of rocks, which are very attractive to bait fish. Little bitty bluegill love to hide in little bitty crevices between where the rocks are laying. There's also some brush piles. Brush piles on the middle attract bait fish such as bluegill. But on the outside of the brush piles, the bass like to come in and just wait for one of those little nuggets of food to swim out so he can snatch it and eat it. There's also kinds of things, uh, in the middle of this pond there's a, a duck island. So the ducks can have places to hide in the bay, I mean to, to, to roost. But right under that duck island, you can bet there's going to be bluegill congregated under there. Another thing that's important about habitat is put it in proximity to where you can fish it. So don't only think about the fish, also think about the angler because you want to be able to catch some fish off of that brush and that structure and that rock pile stuff too. And that's your pro tip for today.